Hi everyone, I hope you are having a wonderful day. Welcome once again to Pam Reading Freya. Uh, this video is going to be general reading for everyone under the sign of Taurus. Let's begin. So, open the receipt. General reading for everyone under the sign of Taurus. We have the five, I mean the four of swords. <clears throat> The Hierophant in the reverse position, the Magician reverse, Three of Swords, Ten of uh, Wands reverse, Ace of um, Wands. I want to see what's the energy. It's a person, King of Pentacles reverse. It's another person, King of Pentacles. I mean, King, Knight, and the Two of um, Pentacles. Okay, let's see. Um, let me see what's the card of card because it might be important. Where will guide everyone under the sign of Taurus? The rest of for Taurus, month of April. Okay, I got the deck and pull out a card. Okay, why? We have why. Let me show you the car. Oops, okay, there you have it. Why? Okay. Okay, so the first thing I began seeing for some of you um, under the sign of Taurus is um, for the month of April, a situation where you or someone in the family could be uh, visiting a doctor. Maybe this is because you are not feeling too good. Visiting a doctor. You can be the patient. For some of you, you will be the patient. But some of you, um, it could be that you are um, visiting someone or accompanying someone. Okay. This could also be that um, indications that there could be a health issue. Maybe you are not feeling too good. Um, this can this can have many variations. Okay, it can be a um, a cold or something related to your stomach. Like um, I don't know what I but I, what I'm feeling is um, maybe issues with the stomach or um, infections in the stomach some infections in the stomach and for some of you i am seeing someone might be receiving stitches and the part that it can be um hurt it can be the head the back of the head or forehead of, or eyes okay so be careful um don't don't go uh don't be too much on the go. And this, um, when I say too much on the go, it's because sometimes um, for us, Taurus, we are sometimes on the go, 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 trying to finish everything we need to do, trying to, um, to, to do things fast. And sometimes we're doing things too fast. Uh, we can run the risk of um, not paying attention. Okay? So please be careful. And... Um, be aware of possible accidents, but most of it, most of all, what I will recommend um, to everyone for you under the sign of Taurus is to listen to your body and do not ignore. Go and get it treated. Visit to your doctor. See what is really going on there. There is going to be some situations in the month of April that you are going to uh, say, no, okay, I've, I've done this before. And I'm really not going to handle the situation um, the way it should be handled. Uh, this can mean that you are not going to be willing or flexible to follow things step by step. Or if you have to apply for something or you have to apply for something, you might think, be thinking in the month of April, 
I'm going to skip these steps and I'm going to do it my way. Um, it is okay to um, think and ways to do things differently and out of the box. But I, I'm just getting that the things that many of you are going to be doing are not going to be accepted by, it could be the family members. If, if you are a woman under the sign of Taurus, it's not going to be well accepted by your wife or children. And there is going to be like, but why are you doing that that way? It's not going to work or that's not how you're supposed to do that kind of stuff. Okay. Maybe this is also in uh, concerns to your health because you might be thinking, well, I done that. I visited the doctor and that is not working for me. Okay. Now I'm going to do things my way. Maybe you decide I'm going to try this home remedy and maybe that is what is going to work for you. Okay. For many of you, uh, you can be dealing with a person that is not using what she knows or what she is supposed to be doing in a place. And this could be a place where applications can be filled. Um, it could be schools. It could be um, gatherings where people gather. But this can also be places in forms of education or guidance, okay? School, churches, um, places where you go to apply for paperwork. Uh, if you are trying to rent, maybe uh, the lady and the desk that is going to fill your paperwork. If you are um, applying for um, medical things or a government health, anything that has to do with organizations, you might be dealing with a person that is not going to be helpful to you or is not using her abilities in the right way. Maybe it's because this person doesn't like her work or doesn't, it's too tired of the day that you go. Maybe try to be understandable. Don't hit this person in the wrong way by being argumentative, but maybe letting that situation pass and come back later is what I see it might help you. Because it can be a stubbornness because you are trying to do things your way. Okay, you're thinking, I don't need to bring all this. I don't need to show all this. Why are you asking me for this paperwork again if I already brought it in? What is going on? You are in your mentality that everything is there and she is not willing to help. Or he, it can be a he or a she, okay? This person is not willing to help. So um, maybe say, okay, just tell me what I need and I will come back another day. Because that day, the day that you go, whatever it is, I just see things not working out. And this could be also that you might not be feeling well and you don't have the time or don't have the energy that day to deal with all the things necessary. Okay, they can, there can be a situation, this can be a hurtful situation that can involve up to three people. This can mean that it could be you, your husband, and an outsider. You, um, your son, a family member, and your husband. Something hurtful, something that maybe you didn't expect it that it could happen. And to me, it could be a situation with one of your children. Even though I don't have any cards that show children, it's just a feeling that I get. Maybe he had an accident, like I said, stitches or something like that. Please remain calm. Don't uh, freak out and, and breathe, okay? Breathe, breathe because um, I can see how it also it's going to be resolved. It's a temporary situ situation. If this is more in love relationships, the person that you are dealing with 
if you are a woman, this is a person that is just looking for his interest. And I'm going to say it. This person, if you are a woman, is just looking for, um, for affection and intimate um, relationships, okay? There's going to be a point in the month of April where you're going to decide, okay, maybe it's time for me to begin putting one by one all my worries to the floor. I'm not going to... It's like I'm seeing you deciding I'm not going to be making all these efforts for all the people around me because I'm really not feeling it or you decide I'm not going to do it anymore. Okay, there is a burdens putting down and burning and burdens and saying maybe in some way um, I'm done with this and leaving it and leaving it at that at least for now. There is going to be also be, this is more by the end of March, situations where you are going to have to take action, where you are going to have to take action and following up is going to be necessary. You're going to have an opportunity if something went wrong in applications, in paperwork, in a relationship, you have to act up on uh, plans and ideas or on resolving that situation because the opportunity is going to be given to you. But the, per the question, why? Why? If you have so much knowledge, if you have so much um, inner wisdom, why are you deciding not to open that part of you and use it in the best of your abilities. Because maybe for some of you, Taurus, you are going to be very confused mentally and emotionally because we have a hurtful situation that is happening. It could be in the family that includes up to three people and you also are not feeling either well or don't have the energy to resolve. For some of you that are a man under the sign of Taurus, there is a possibility that um, initiating something, if, if this is in job occupations or in, um, in plans or desires you had in the near past, there is a possibility of you maybe losing your job or procrastinating into fixing or remedy or solve a situation where you have to be there, where you have to show interest, when you have to put the, you have to act. You have to act upon this and you, and for some of you that are Taurus men, I'm seeing you deciding not to, you decided not to, I will do it tomorrow. I, um, I have time. I don't have to act up on this right now. And with that, um, you can be losing um, important opportunities. So please recharge your batteries. If you are not feeling well, uh, listen to your body. Take care of that. And when this opportunity to act up on resolving either family complications or something that is implants in your ideas and your desires, don't leave it for tomorrow because that opportunity is not always going to be there. This can also mean that one per one one man is going to be in the picture. It's like you, maybe your wife and another man. And this man, if you're not gonna if you are not willing to be doing that, I can do it. I can do it. And this other man is coming with everything. Um emotional support, actions. Um, this man is um, it's like in a hurry. I don't know why I see him, him in a hurry. Um, yes, I will support. Yes, I have the money. Yes, I, I, can, I can do it. 
when do you want me to do it? If this is a situation that is in the family, um, this man, if you are a woman, you have a male that is very procrastinating and lazy, and you have another male um, that is um, that you can rely on. You can rely on this man, and you can trust on this man that he is going to do, and and not just do, but back up his work with actions and um, and decisions. I think there is going to be a situation if you are a woman um, that is going to include two men. And if you are a man, this can be a hurtful situation where three men can be, or there is um, your partner and two men. Uh, overall, um, by the end of April, I see that you are going to be off, um, off balance. This can indicate that you don't really know what to do, that you can make a choice right now, maybe because you are not sure about what you want or what is best for you. And you are trying to, to think about, but you think about what is best for you. But I think that all, all the, you are very knowledgeable, you are very wise. Um, you might be feeling, I have to postpone it for a little bit, but I can just see how that turns around and you are deciding, this is what I'm going to do. I'm dropping this and I'm taking this with me. I'm not willing to, to maybe be dealing any longer with, um, with, with a choice that you need, you know, you need to make and you finally making it. Maybe you finally deciding to open your book of knowledge and use it in the right way. Use it in your advantage, not against you. And maybe that is what is going to um, to move you more into the right direction. But for this, accessing the knowledge, I don't see it until the end of April, even moving more into March. So Taurus, uh, please um, take it easy. Listen to your body. When it comes to hurtful situations, um, try to access your inner guidance, okay? Your inner guidance. If it's time to act up on ideas and decisions that are needed to be made, um, please do so. And please know that um, as, as soon as you decide to maybe accept your inner feelings or what you already know, that is when I see things uh, beginning to resolve for you. But I don't know why I feel like a hesitant. So don't be so hesitant, don't procrastinate, don't leave things for later, and don't let, most of all, good opportunities to act up on dreams and desires pass you by because you think you can take your sweet time. Okay, don't do that. Thank you for allowing me. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And turn on the bell so you can get the notifications to receive the next video for the month of May. Also, if you would like to have a private reading with me, in the description box uh, is going to be the information on how to do that. Thank you for allowing me. I wish you all a wonderful day. Bye.